Welcome to this NMP flight video tutorial. This video will look at delay alerting and a feature to mark a delay as being seen. I'll start by going to the organization configuration, which under the options, I select shared configurations and then in a new browser tab, the shared configurations open and I must make sure I've selected the user alerts tab. Here I can change the colors of the delay alerting in my flight list or the values associated to the different colors. The values have to be in sequential order, otherwise an error is given. I can also select whether the mark as seen feature is enabled for my organization and also the parameters associated to the mark as seen here minus 15 and plus 20. So in my flight list, I have the delay values colored as per my organization's default and for flights in my organization I can see the mark as seen icon. As an individual user if I go into the manage alerts dialog the delay user alerts is always present I cannot delete it and I can see the values that have been set for my organization and at first login I can see the default colors of my organization as well as whether the mark is seen is active and what the parameters minus 15 plus 20 in this case are. The only option to change for an individual user is to change the color and once changed that will be saved with the user preferences and will never be overridden by any change in future to the organization color defaults. So in my flight list, the mark as seen is used when enabled to show the little eye icon only for my flights or for flights where the organization have delegated access to me. So in this case, in the flight list as a FedEx user, I only see the mark as seen icon in my two flights. So as a user, I can select the mark delay as seen and click it and the color goes to gray although at the start of the cell the original color associated with that delay value is still shown and a little tick is put there to say that I have seen that delay. There are two ways for that tick to go back to be in the eye icon. I can do it manually by unmarking the delay as seen or using the parameters that have been set for my organization of minus 15 or plus 20, if the delay value changes by more than those parameters, the eye icon will return automatically. So in this case at minus 15, if the delay suddenly went to one minute, that's more than 15 minutes less than 18, I would see the icon also, if the delay got significantly worse by more than 20 minutes, so if it suddenly had a 40 minute delay, again, that I couldn't revert to the I. That's all for this video. Thanks for watching.